Few of us leave lasting footprints. We are here, and then soon, we are gone. We'd like to think there's a saying, old as the sea herself. The good that men do lives after them. The RNLI exists to save lives at sea. You're in, you're out. Down the long corridor of history from generation to generation, that is what we do. It is what we've always done since our formation in 1824. A legacy left now in your will is one way of outlasting a lifetime, of leaving an enduring testimonial to the standards and values of timeless courage, service and selflessness that you and those you loved have always cherished. Our volunteer, unpaid crews are called out more than 7,000 times each year. Each year, more than 8,000 people are rescued from the sea, given back to their loved ones by the selfless courage of strangers they have never met. These, you could say, are the faces of courage. Each of these men and women has been awarded medals for courage, seamanship, and fortitude, for saving life at sea. There are hundreds of faces like these, thousands of volunteer crewmen and women scattered around these island shores, ready to respond at a moment's notice, give all that they have so that others may live. That courage. Timeless as the sea they challenge every day of every year is the lifeblood of our institution. It lies at the core of our belief. The Royal National Lifeboat Institution is a charity supported almost entirely by public donation. At its warm heart stand our lifeboats, housed in over 200 stations that stand sentinel around the coastline of Britain and Ireland. A ring of safety around our coast from St. David's in Wales to Penlee in Cornwall. From Ramsgate to Sligo, Kilkeel to Kirkwall in the Orkneys, our crews stand ready to launch every moment of every day to risk all for a stranger. It costs more than £330,000 every day to provide that service of help and support, that ring of safety around our shores. Yet the chilling truth is this. Six out of every ten launches would never happen if it were not for the money left to the RNLI by people like you. Legacies left in proud memory of those loved, lost, but never forgotten. Without money left to the RNLI in legacies, 60% of those rescues might never have happened. 60% of those precious lives might not have been saved. Often people leave us money for general purposes, which is particularly useful because we know what the most urgent need is at any particular moment in time. But other times people would like to apply the money to something specific, for example, this lifeboat behind us, which was only made possible through a very generous bequest. 60% of our income, and therefore 60% of our expenditure, comes from legacies. It costs £330,000 every day to run the RNLI, and £200,000 of that comes from legacies. When you leave a legacy to the RNLI, it's the giving that counts, not the amount. Yes, it's true. Sometimes entire boats have been paid for through a bequest or legacy. But donations of that size are the hugely generous exception, not the rule. With the RNLI, every call-out counts, and so too does every penny. Lifeboats can't save lives without radar and fenders, ropes and searchlights. And we won't send our volunteers into danger, out to sea, without boots and life jackets, helmets and gloves. Legacies can pay for them too, and for lifeboat crew training. That's a lifesaver all by itself. Yet it costs a thousand pounds a year just to keep each crewman safe and up to date with the skills he must have to survive, 
while saving others. We have four and a half thousand crewmen. A legacy from you, especially a residuary gift, can help pay for them all. From a pair of gloves to a set of charts. From flares to tins of self-heating soup for survivors. Nothing you give will be wasted. How will crews directly benefit? How will your gift help save lives? Let the crewmen tell you themselves. As a crew member with a D-class lifeboat, your legacy can buy something that costs as little as £16. A pair of gloves. A helmet, which will cost 180 which is indispensable to us in the lifeboat. £100 will enable the lifeboat station to purchase the RNLI training handbook. And £380 will cover the cost of sending a crew member on an accredited coastal skipper course. Every piece of equipment on this boat was purchased by donations and legacies. From the radio, the ropes, to the simple compass, is all valuable equipment needed for us to fulfill our role in life saving at sea. Legacies live on. And so too, in your name, or in the name of those you still love, will the men, women and children we rescue next week next month, next year, and in the sunlit years beyond. We pass on, but the courage of our crews is timeless. The Royal National Lifeboat Institution. We exist for one purpose only, to save lives at sea. But we cannot do it without you. So please remember others by remembering us. The prospect of us not receiving any money from legacies is just too appalling to even contemplate. The RNLI would not be able to continue its work in the way that it does now. And it's really not exaggerating to say that lives would be lost. For more details about leaving a legacy to the RNLI, contact our legacy team on 01202 663032 or visit our website at www.rnli.org.uk.